Ukraine's President Zelensky has secured attack drones and more missiles from the UK's Prime Minister Rishi Sunak, but returns home with no fighter jets. Zelensky has been canvassing more military support from London, Paris, Berlin and Rome and seems to have been successful. President Emmanuel Macron won't send planes either, but confirmed France will continue to help Ukraine resist Russia. Nous avons décidé de livrer de nouvelles munitions. Nous avons décidé aussi et surtout maintenant de bâtir sur, avec les Ukrainiens à l'est du pays des éléments pour former leurs troupes, former les bataillons qui seront en charge de mener la contre-offensive et de résister et de réparer les véhicules, les canons, parce que c'est aussi ça ce dont l'Ukraine a besoin. The White House's national security spokesperson has warned that Iran and Russia are expanding their unprecedented defense partnership. He said Iran remains Russia's top military backer and has provided Russia with artillery and tank rounds for use in Ukraine. In occupied Crimea, Russia is marking the five-year anniversary of the opening of the Kerch Bridge linking the Crimea Peninsula to mainland Russia. Last year it was damaged by a truck bomb. The bridge is symbolic of Moscow's claim on the territory.